they're so, so cute, right? But if you or your neighbors have a really loud dog that barks all the time like that, take a look at this here in our studio. This is the device that claims it's going to stop your dog from barking. Mm -hmm. The product says it uses ultrasonic sound to keep your pet quiet. But the question is, does it really work? That is the question tonight that our 13 Investigates team thought they were going to take on. So they bought the device and they tested it. That way... You don't have to. Here's senior investigative reporter Bob Siegel. What do you do? What do you do? Diana Calkins adores her two dogs, but she's the first to admit Juju and Vicky are not always perfect little angels. We have a lot of barking. Anytime anyone comes in, they bark. Incessant barking the whole time the neighbor knows is one. They bark at the neighbor's dogs and they go crazy. One of them always stirs up the other, no matter which ones. Hey! With these little dogs, it's a very, very high pitch, and it hurts your ears. That's why this caught Diana's eye. The outdoor bark control says it uses ultrasonic sound to stop dogs from barking. The little plastic house has a microphone inside, and when it hears the sound of barking, it sends out a high-pitched sound heard only by dogs. That unpleasant, startling sound is supposed to get your dog to stop yapping. The question, of course... Does it work? Juju, Vicky, and Diana agreed to give it a try. Setup was easy. Batteries in, read instructions, and give the device a quick test. Woof! It worked. Then Diana set the outdoor bark control on her patio table to see what would happen. Unfortunately, nothing. The first few days were so hot, the dogs didn't really spend any time outside. So Diana moved the device indoors something the manufacturer does not recommend. I just wasn't worried about that. She did notice an immediate impact. The minute I turned it on, they stopped barking. Watch what happens when we knock on the front door and ring the doorbell. Huge triggers for both of the dogs. Definitely a difference. They would have been barking like crazy. It definitely worked. But Diana's excitement did not last long. When Juju and Vicky finally went outside to play in the yard, well, the neighbor's dogs decided they wanted to come out and play too. Things got very noisy. The outdoor bark control says it effectively stops barking up to 50 feet away. Obviously, no one bothered to tell Juju and Vicky. As soon as those dogs came out, they were all barking like crazy. Obviously, it didn't work on the neighbor dogs either, and we were within 10 or 15 feet of the box, and there seemed to be no effect at all. If you do want to try a device or a collar that uses ultrasonic sound to keep your dog quiet, well, are products like these safe for your pet? I believe yes, within reason. Meredith and Gersky manages several animal clinics. She says devices like this are generally safe if used for just a few months to help train your dog. But she has not heard of many pet owners who found them to be very effective. I've seen people try and use it and come in and say that it hasn't worked because their dog is just fighting through it. They're just barking at whatever source or whatever reason. It's barking to begin with. So bottom line, does this thing work? Primarily, I'm just not sure. She saw some good and some not so good, definitely leaving her wanting more, more peace and quiet. <laughs> Overall, Diana gives the uh, outdoor bark control a C minus. If you want to give it a try, it's available online for between 30 and $45. Wow. So a C minus is, you know, it's passing. Not a fail. Yeah, but yeah. it is some right. mixed reviews there. So how do you stop a dog from barking then? Had a chance to talk to some professional dog trainers, mm -hmm. and they tell me there are things you can do right now at home, and it starts with understanding why your dog is barking. Mm -hmm. We've got tips and also a video explaining exactly what to do. That will be posted here in just a little while on WTHR.com. It's all about communicating and knowing your dog, knowing your pooch, <laughs> knowing what they're trying to say to you. Yeah, <laughs> and, and, and one of the trainers kind of compared it to having a baby. Yeah. If the baby's crying, right. you don't want it 
I mean, there's a need there's behind a need. the cry yeah. there. So Answer there's a need behind yeah. the bark. You want to try and figure right. out what that is so you can attack the problem and not mm -hmm. just the barking itself. Got a, lot of, got a feeling that a lot of folks right now are going to WTHR.com to find out yeah. what your tips are. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks good. so much, Bob. We appreciate You're it. Welcome. And if there's a product that you would like 13 Investigates to test out, let us know. Send us information about the product to 13investigates at WTHR.com.